guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Saturday, October 9th. And today I want to share with you my next moving stitch square. <laughs> Anyways, the letter was uh, P this time. Um, yeah, okay, <laughs> let's make sure. I did O, right? Yeah. So I'm, I picked Disney's Peter Pan, the cartoon, the old one. I don't know when that came out. <laughs> but I grew up watching the Disney uh, classics like On Repeat because my mom. Uh, censored things that we watched. <laughs> I was trying to think of, you know, like we didn't watch a lot of TV and stuff. We watched movies, you know, that were kid friendly. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Anyways, we grew up on Disney and I watched Disney on repeat <laughs> growing up. Peter Pan was always one of my favorites. And actually one of my favorite movies is Hook, which is a Peter Pan story. It's the one that's got um, Robin Williams in it and Julia Roberts and Dustin Hoffman. <laughs> and I absolutely love that one. But this is for the old well, really, this would go with any Peter Pan movie, and uh, I wanted to do something kind of simple, but still was for the movie. So I just picked out a dark blue color and a white, and made this. <laughs> so this is the uh, second star to the right, <laughs> right here, which is where Neverland is. I don't know if it's reversed in the. I don't think it's reversed. And then I just put a bunch of little like regular stars, which took forever. And look at the back. <laughs> I'm gonna line the back of my blanket, so I don't care that it looks like that. But, um, so I did the big star and the little star and then all the little regular stars for it. This is Red Heart Scrap Yarn. This is white. And I'm not sure what this blue is called. But I know it's Red Heart because the way it feels. It's just a dark, like, navy blue. And, uh, yeah. So I thought it was cute. This square turned out huge. <laughs> I think I used the wrong side hook. But it's just going to be a little bit bigger than my other squares. And I'm going to make it work. <laughs> I'm not worried about it. Um, I think I was supposed to use an H hook. And I believe I used an I hook on this one. So it came out bigger, <laughs> but I'm not worried about it. I'll make it work. But yeah, I think it's so cute. So I just stitched these on there and I just went crazy with the little stars. <laughs> and uh, I think it's cute. I like it. I'm, I'm happy with it. So next is Q. I have no idea what I'm going to do for Q. <laughs> I'll have to look around on all the different streaming services and see what I can find for Q. Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> I can't even think of if I've ever watched a uh, Q movie before. I don't know. <laughs> but this is my P. So I'm excited about it. Yeah, so that's getting there. There's only a few left, right? Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Ten. There's ten left. Hmm. So it's going to be interesting. I'm hoping I can finish this before the end of the year, but I don't know if I will. <laughs> it really depends on my energy levels. They keep going up and down. Like today, I had planned on sewing uh, some more, but I'm just really tired from yesterday. I had to do a lot of laundry from where Jesse was sick and uh, just like regular house cleaning up things that kind of got neglected the last week while he was sick. And uh, now I'm tired. <laughs> so I think I might rest today. And if I feel like it tomorrow, I'll do some more sewing. So the next shop update will probably be um, Tuesday the 12th, I believe. Yeah, because Wednesday, Je Jesse has to go get his teeth cleaned. Um, that's the 13th. Also, I will be six months pregnant on Wednesday. I'll be 23 weeks, which is the first week of the sixth month of pregnancy. <laughs> so that's exciting. But anyways, I'm blabbing now. I'm going to hop off here. Jesse fell asleep on the couch because he woke up super early. His schedule's all messed up from when he was sick. So we gotta, now that he's feeling better, we got to get him back on his schedule. But I'm going to let him take a little bit of a nap because he's been up since almost 3 a.m. <laughs> he woke up super early today. And... Um, so yeah, I'm gonna let him nap for a little while and then wake him up and then try to get him in bed at his regular bedtime tonight and get back in his schedule. He's off of school next week for fall break, so it worked out perfectly. So he has a whole week to completely recover from being sick, from the, you know, the tiredness of being worn out. And um, we can get him back on his daily schedule and all that and hopefully get back into our groove. <laughs> that is the plan, but we'll see. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna hop off here and I'll see you guys in my next Moving Stitch video, which will be eventually for Q. I have no idea what I'm going to do. <laughs> I'll have to look at movies. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.